a $20 bill could be getting a makeover. The Department of Treasury is expected to announce changes to the bill later on this week. Now, right now, Andrew Jackson, war hero, president, and of course, Tennessean, is on the bill, but he may be replaced with a woman. News Channel 5's Jesse Knutson has reaction from the Hermitage. The seventh president of the United States, Andrew Jackson, has been on the $20 bill for almost 100 years, but soon that could change. You'll see a lot of things about New Orleans inside. When you walk into the Hermitage, the impact Andrew Jackson had on our country and Tennessee is apparent. Jackson had a lot to do with making Nashville a far more well-known prominent city as well. And while the Hermitage may focus on the accomplishments of the war hero and seventh president of the United States, they don't shy away from controversy, like Jackson's involvement in the Trail of Tears. He's a good reminder to people of our past, our complicated past. But that complicated past Jackson was involved in has sparked controversy surrounding his place on the $20 bill, with many believing he should be removed and replaced with a woman. To totally remove Jackson would be a, a mistake. After hearing about changes to the $10 bill, the Hermitage knew changes could come to the $20 bill, but they don't believe Jackson, who has been on the bill since 1928, should be attacked for his controversial past. And I think if we look at any president and only focus on um, the negatives, and they all have negatives, uh, we'd have a very different opinion of them. President of the Hermitage, Howard Cattell, admits that Jackson made mistakes. In the 21st century point of view, it was a really bad idea. But those mistakes, and more importantly, Jackson's successes shaped our country into what it is today. And he hopes that's enough to keep Jackson on one of the most widely used bills in the world. Now, there has been no official announcement to say whether Jackson will be replaced on the $20 bill. And if he is replaced, there's no telling who could actually be on the next $20 bill. At the Hermitage, Jesse Knutson, News Channel 5. I don't think it'll be Jesse, though. If the Department of Treasury goes through with a change to the 20, by the way, it actually wouldn't happen until the year 2030.